503 it is. Three minutes after five and then it's time now for a traffic report. The traffic magician with Peter J. Wiggins on this. Wednesday. Evening and we're gonna start off in downtown Boston where Tip O'Neill Tunnel congestion on both sides from Store Drive and the Zaken Bridge all the way out to Massachusetts Turnpike and it's bumper to bumper on both sides of those. Tip O'Neill Tunnel Store Drive congestion from 2A all the way out to Glevick Deck 30 East Pottsdale, so 12 Circus Time here. South Beach Express Rihanna and South Pond Time congestion for the Rest Pike all the way out to 203 and then we congestion ourselves out to the Bray Tree Split, so 12 Circus Time, okay? Website WCVB.com, you will find us. 93 door. Congestion of the South Beach Express Expressway from the Bray Tree Split all the way out to safety breach in one of the state's reservoirs. South Beach Expressway, but it's congestion around Morsi Boulevard, but it's Trestle Observe Time, okay? Route 1, a little congestion on the South Pond side as you approach 93 in Charlestown and Route 1 North congestion around 93 to the Charlestown Navy Yard of Rise. It's good to go except for the little slow spots in Route 1 near the area of Route 60 and Revere's Trail Surface so Extra Time, okay? And Route 1, more on fire from Revere to Peabody, 1A. North. Security blanket is moving on congestively from Banton Street 145 to Boardman Street. Bye bye. That is good girl from Boston all the way out to Revere. Mass Pike congested from Fenway Park to the Prude Tunnel and then to the Ted Williams Tunnel on the eastbound side. Westbound side, a little congestion around the air with Ted Williams Tunnel and 90 Mass Pike westbound. We congested from the Austin Branch Holes away at the exit 17 in Newton and Mass Pike will congested on exit 16, route 16 in Newton, stretching to Newtonville and one Mass Pike will congested on the area of route 20, 120 in the western on the westbound side of Mass Pike. But otherwise, it's good to go from western all the way to Sierra Ridge. Was doing that seven people 93 south toward the car can very slow bumper to bumper from Semler Square and Semerville to the Zaken Bridge in Boston on the southbound side of 93 northbound 93 little congestion the Zaken Bridge all the way out to Mystic Valley Parkway in Medford here and a little congestion around here at Fellsway Park in from the MWRA Falls Reservation So trust the Preserve Time, we're in here at 93, okay? Route 2 A little congestion to approach here with 2316 in Cambridge and Route 2 West A little congestion around here with Route 62 in West Concord to 2A in Concord And Route 2 Concord turn back, a little congestion around here with Route 2A in Concord 128 is more fine from Peabody to Gloucester, except for a little slow spot on 128. North is the put to the end of 128 in Gloucester on the Gloucester Roadway, so trail to extra time, okay? They're supposed to be in court at a later date. At the Quam Reservoir, I'm Jack Harper, WCBB. And 120 stretches more on from both sides from Reading to Peabody. But on the 120 north, congested from. Broke into her Mission Hill townhouse, tied her up. Kidnapped her for Mass Pike in Weston all the way out to 93 in Redden, so trial starts their time here. 90, 5 one way to a little congestion from Route 3 in Burlington all the way out to Route 9 in Wellesley, so trial starts their time. And 120 bumper to bumper from 135 in children. Need them all the way out to 95 in Westwood. It's the trust of their time. One twenty eight North Little Congestion, one thirty five to one of them between two thousand four and two thousand eight. Tonight he is free and twenty five thousand dollars in the Highland Avenue exit in Needham Stretch. Okay. And the Brain Tree Split, 128 South Little Congestion from ninety three in Brain Tree Split to thirty seven Trust of Extra Time. Okay. It happened last Thursday around noon time. If you were there, if you have any information, mm. you're resting. 93 and 95 are more on fine from 120 to the New Hampshire border. And 93 North will congestion is approached to the New Hampshire border. And it's stretched all the way to New Hampshire, trust after a time. Route 3 North will congestion from 62 and Burlington all the way out to. Concord Road, then Bill Rickers Trust X Amalites. You're good to go on three from 120 to the New Hampshire border here. Yeah. 495, go on both sides, Mainsbury to Lawrence, and 495 North congestion around here with 
Exit 45A in Lawrence, stretching all the way out to 110 in Lawrence, there's the trust extra time and what? And 495, launch stretch, a little congestion on there, loop 114, and North End over launch, stress extra time, okay? And 495 is congestion from Route 3 and Chelmsford, low stretch all the way up to Whipple Road and Tewksbury, so trust extra time, okay? By the way, Route 45 is good go from Marlboro to Chelmsford, and 495, North congestion from uh, Route 9 in we don't know where the bucks West Burrow, we got to 290 in, in Marlboro, um, the North Bronx are 495. But otherwise, it's good to go on the stuff on 29 in Marlboro to Mass Pike in West Burrow, and 495 from West Burrow all the way out to Wareham. Here, 95 South, low congestion on the rear, Route 1 this will not be about in the Walpole Foxborough Sharon stretch of Route 1 South. So trust her third time, otherwise you're good to go from 128 northbound side of 95 will go from the run on border to Route 128, but 95 congestion from Route 1 in Walpole all the way up to 95, 495 in Foxburg in Mansfield, so trust her third time, okay? 24, a little congestion around here if you put Route 24 from 120 and in Randolph, but otherwise you could go from Yes. Randolph to Raynham and 24 South Little congestion area of Route 25 and Raynham, so trust X on Bedard. You're good to go from Raynham all the way out to Fall River and to the run on border. Route 3, Milan congestion as you approach the Braintree Street Bedard. It's good to go from Braintree to Sagamore. 44 Milan 5 from Middleborough to Plymouth. 140 Milan 5 from Thompson to New Bedford. 140, okay, let's take a look at Red Island Traffic Picture. 146 North congestion from 99 and Winsocket all the way out to Sales Hill Road and well, in North Smithfield there. 99, a little congestion from 120. To in Cumberland, there. 471. Google provided the day's biggest boost. 295 North Little congestion around here, Route 37 in Warwick and West Warwick, but it's good to go from Warwick to Alabama here. 146 South. Congestion from Branch Avenue exit and Providence all the way up to 95 and Providence Trust up to the time here. 95, good to go from Pawtucket to exit 25 on the south, northbound side of the southbound stretch. Congestion from 126 all the way up to downtown Providence with Route 195. 610 connector, congestion from the 610 split all the way out to 95 and Providence there. And 195, congestion from Broadway Street all the way up to 95 and Providence here. Trust of the time. Route 10 congestion approach with 95 and Providence there. 95, more 5 from Providence all the way out to Wesley on both sides. Route 4, more 5 from East Greenwich to North Kingstown. Route 37 is more 5 to 95 and 95. TF Green Airport Connectors, Mall Fine, 130 to Mall Fine from North King, San New Newport to Newport to Portsmouth. 20, route 6, Mall Fine from San Morda to Orleans, except for a little congestion spot on Route 6 East from 134 and then Dennis to 124 out in Harwich and 6 Mall congestion from 124 to 134. Here. And Route 20 North, we'll get just around here with the foreign word with Route 6. That's me for the Traveling Word Magician on this evening report. This is PJ Wednesday. Have a good day with a good podcast. Bye for now, here.